So what's up you guys, I'm back here in nature. Now this last past weekend, I got really back in nature. I went to the ocean, I went to Florida to see my mom and celebrate her birthday. Now on this whole journey, me getting back to nature, getting back to myself, I realized some things by looking at the water. One thing about water, water is something to cleanse. You think about water, how it rains, it cleans the earth, how it goes around rivers, it cleans the earth. When we drink water ourselves, it cleans our body, removes the toxics out of our body. When we drink water, in the morning, it gives us more energy. Water is an essence to life. This is my mom. I was born because her water broke. Water is a beautiful thing and it helps with cleansing the body. And when I was looking at this water, it made me think of some of the things I need to do while I'm there, while I'm there in Florida, while I'm going back to this nature vibe, getting back to myself, getting back to my essence. And that's what the Buddhists say, find inner peace here within. And that's why I went home to go see my parents, my mom and my dad, because I am essentially both of them. A little bit in there of my dad and a little bit in there of my mom became me. I was at all spring. Seeing them is helping me bring my inner peace. Hearing lessons from my dad, being in my mom's arms, little things like that. It helped to become inner peace. And if you people out there who don't have parents, at least look at some of them guardians, maybe some siblings, or someone you call brothers or sisters. Someone who's there for you, who grew with you within childhood who watch you become a little baby to a teen to an adult. When cleansing your body with inner peace, it's one of the things you can't get from counseling, you can't get from your parents or anything like that. It's one of the things that, yes, counseling your parents and other things may aid you, but you have to look within yourself. You got to put in your mind, the mind over matter, that yes, I'll become a better person. I will get back to myself and get back to the happy person that I once was when I was a little kid, a baby, bouncing around with that joyless feeling that you just, the carefree feeling that you're just free of this world, walking around just doing little silly stuff, looking at your finger and being happy out of it. That's the way we get back within life. Giving back in nature, this is something that we're doing. It's not the exact steps, but it's baby steps of getting back to when you were a baby. I talked about being free as a bird, flying in the wind, being like squirrels crawling, jumping everywhere. But you also gotta be playful, joyous as a baby. Have that childlike behavior even in your adulthood. Now as kids, we're all rushing to be adults, rushing to be adults. But as adults, we should rush to be kids and have that free, that childish mindset that a lot of them have. Not necessarily going around saying <laughs> nan nan bobo or anything like that. But just having free, having that joy. You remember being a kid and just being happy about the smallest things in life? You pick up a blade of grass and just look at it like... And just look at it like... It's the most beautiful thing in the world. And really it is the most beautiful thing in the world. Or one of the most beautiful things in the world. Because this right here is life. A lot of us don't realize how much life is around us. And life is truly all around us. And just like this is life, this little blade of grass that a lot of us take for granted because it helps us breathe oxygen well one of the things that help us breathe is oxygen you are life as well and you help others around you breathe oxygen you give life to others and when you find the inner peace within yourself you're going to give life to others as well as yourself you're going to be a happy person you're going to be a joyous person and you're going to find your nature you are way more than what you think you are and when you get back to yourself get back to your inner mind get back to your inner peace find that nature within yourself you're going to see that now it may take a higher step it may take a journey but realize you're not alone there's worlds all around you just get back to nature and just listen there's birds there's trees life is around you it may not be human connection but it's connection out there so with that being said i want to tell anybody's out there Get back to your nature, get back to your vibe, find the inner peace, cut off the negative people in your life, re back, revisit the people in your life, maybe revisit the places. You don't have to be involved, but just get back where you can see the bad things, bring out the positive within the negative, and then get back to your inner peace. Now these are not all the steps that's completing yourself getting back to nature, but these are the baby steps, the few steps of getting back to your nature, getting back to the beautiful person that you are because you are not the damaged person that this world made you be. You're not this abused victim, you're not this hurt person, this abused child or anything like that. You are a beautiful person, you are yourself and I want to tell anyone who's watching this video, share love, spread love and peace you guys. Get back to your vibe. I'm